question 22. So I've divided this pentagon up into these three triangles. Now these two blue triangles are the same size. So how I'm, and I've called these two triangles x and y. So I've got non-right angle triangles here, but I do know uh, the trapped angle and the sides both uh, the sides either side of it. So the area of a triangle is given at the f in the formula sheet at the front is half AB sin C, where where my angle C is my 105 and my um, two um, trapped angle sides are A and B, are, are the 12 and the 8. Okay, so my area of these two triangles here is half times 12 times 8 times sin 105. So each of those is 46.36. So I've got two of those. Right, now, um, I want to try and work out um, the area of this triangle. So I'm going to do this by way of... Um, uh, base times perpendicular height, okay. Base times perpendicular height, um, but uh, so eventually I'm going to want want to work out the length of that line, that perpendicular line down there. I'm calling this point Q R Q. Now I'm going to have to work my way up to that. To start with, I'm going. I I know this length is 6.5, but I'm going to need to work out this length here, my P R which I can do going back to this triangle because it's my opposite side okay it's the, uh, it's the opposite side to this so um, uh, so yeah so basically I'm going to work out this length now I can't use the sine rule because I don't have a pair I know this angle but not that side that side but not that angle that side but not that angle so as I can't use the sine rule I'm going to use the cosine rule and I've gone and labeled these bits and be uh, these this blue lettering here is to support this cosine rule um, working so I've got angle A and I've got little b and little c so substituting into that I can work out that this length here which RP also little a is 16.0528 so back to triangle RPQ which I pop down here in purple just worked out RP to be 16.05 dot 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 PQ is obviously half of 13 which is 6.5 allowing me to work out RQ by Pythagoras and working out the shortest side to be 14.677 so I've eventually been able to work out the length RQ so back to my red triangle Z the area of that is half times base times perpendicular height half times 13 times 14.6779 which is 95.406 so for my red triangle is 95.406 both of my blue triangles are 46.3644 so adding two of these and one of these I get 188.13 dot 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 which is 188 to 3 sig figs